What is the longest a person has ever lived for? Meet Li Ching Yuan, a man who lived an astonishing 256 years. And no, this is not a myth or a fictional tale. Today's video will discuss the secret to a long and prosperous life. According to a 1930 New York Times article, Wu Chong Chai, a professor of the Changde University, discovered imperial Chinese government records from 1827 congratulating Li Ching Yuan on his 150th birthday, and further documents later congratulating him on his 200th birthday in 1877. In 1928, a New York Times correspondent wrote that many of the old men in Lee's neighborhood asserted that their grandfathers knew him when they were boys, and that he at that time was a grown man. Li Ching Yuan reportedly began his herbalist career at the age of 10, where he gathered herbs in mountain ranges and learned of their potency for longevity. For almost 40 years, he survived on a diet of herbs such as lingzi, goji berry, wild ginseng, hishu wu and godu cola and rice wine. In 1749, at the age of 71, he joined the Chinese armies as teacher of martial arts. Li was said to be a much-loved figure in his community, marrying 23 times and fathering over 200 children. According to the generally accepted tales told in his province, Li was able to read and write as a child, and by his 10th birthday had traveled in Kansu, Shanxi, Tibet, Annam, Siam, and Manchuria gathering herbs. For the first hundred years he continued at this occupation. Then he switched to selling herbs gathered by others. He sold lingzi, goji berry, wild ginseng, hishu wu and godu cola along with other Chinese herbs, and lived off a diet of these herbs and rice and wine. His secret to long health, Li was asked what his secret was to longevity. This was his reply, keep a quiet heart, sit like a tortoise, walk sprightly like a pigeon and sleep like a dog. These were the words of advice Li gave to Wu Pei Fu, the warlord, who took Li into his house to learn the secret of extremely long life. Li maintained that inward calm and peace of mind combined with breathing techniques were the secrets to incredible longevity. Obviously, his diet would have played a large role. But it's fascinating that the old living person in recorded history attributes his long life to his state of mind. With the average lifespan for the Western world currently sitting between 70 to 85 years, the thought of someone living over 100 years old seems like quite the stretch. The thought of someone living over 200 years old seems extremely suspicious. But why don't we believe that people can live this long? We have to keep in mind that some people in this world don't live a grueling 9 to 5 lifestyle. They don't have to deal with the stresses of debt, they aren't breathing polluted city air, and they exercise regularly. They don't eat refined sugars or flour, or any foods that have had pesticides sprayed on them. They aren't living off of the standard American diet. They also spend their spare time in nature practicing breathing techniques and meditating which have been proven to improve mental, physical, and emotional health. They keep things simple, get proper sleep, and spend a great deal of time in nature under the sun. I do not doubt for a minute that if we all did the things we knew we were supposed to do, that living to be 100 years old would be commonplace. When we treat our bodies right, who knows how long we can live for? What do you think of this important information? Let me know in our comments section below.